So I decided to use the LM2576 to build my power supply. And to figure out how to connect it, I simply look in the datasheet. Here I've connected the circuit in KiCad. So here I have a barrel jack as the input connector. I have a 100 microfarad capacitor on the input. I have a shot key diode I'm using a 100 microhenry inductor and I'm using a 2200 microfarad capacitor on the output. On the output here, I have a 10K potentiometer and then I have a 1K resistor down here. I used the data sheet to, to calculate these values and this should give me around 12 volt output maximum and down to around 1.25 volt at the minimum. So I'll start by connecting this on a breadboard and then see how it goes from there. I started by building a prototype on a breadboard but I was having a lot of trouble measuring so the a lot of the cables were not fastened properly and I was getting weird results so I decided to solder it up on a, on a prototype board so that I would avoid the problem of loose cables so now it looks like this here is this is the output voltage wires I have a barrel connector here to easily connect the input adapter and here I have a simple on off switch. I just tested it now and it seems to work very, very well. I have um, down to around 1.2 volts uh, output and up to, I think it was 13.5 I saw. I'm not sure yet how much current I can get out. I tried it with, um, with 82 ohms and I got 13.5 volts out and that means 160 milliamps. I didn't try any higher because I don't have power resistors that can support a lot of heat. So I only tried it up to 160 milliamps and it works. I would like to try it higher, but right now um, I'm gonna be happy with 160 milliamps. Now that the, the power, the adapter part of the board is finished, I need to add a display that shows me the output voltage that I have so that I know what voltage I'm working with. I have a few ideas, but I haven't decided what to do yet. So I have a couple of these double digit seven segment LED displays and adding them to an Arduino because with an Arduino, it's super easy to read the voltage and then I could easily display the voltage output on these seven segment displays. And this is a little bit big, so I, I also have a small Arduino that basically works the same way. I also have, have this old board. Uh, this is from the kitchen timer course on Omifine. There are some input pins here. I, maybe I could use those to read the voltage input and use this as the display board. I'm not sure, that could be an idea. And now it occurred to me that for the display, I also need power supply. The display needs power to show the voltage. So I need a power supply inside my power supply for my display. Hmm. I need to give this a bit of thought to figure out how to solve this. Um, over the next few days, I'm gonna draw out some ideas and think about it and then Let's see what we end up with.